I just think society has this um, expectation that we always look sexy. I'm in my mid thirties and I can't believe that I haven't thought about this before. So I want to challenge um, really what is put out there for clothing, for um, girls, for women. And I want to share with you a couple of uh, my stories and how I came to this different perspective. Last year, I was looking for a specific outfit for fall for my daughter. I was looking for a two-piece set um, specifically for fall, winter, and I was looking for fleece material because we live up north, it's pretty cold. And at the time, I was looking at their two selections. So they had from two colors for boys, two colors for girls. And one thing that stood out to me was that the boys had both pants and the top shirt uh, made out of fleece, which is the nice thick material what I wanted. The girl version had the fleece on top and the leggings on the bottom. And the leggings were not made out of fleece, even though we do have fleece leggings on the market, as I found out. <laughs> but um, they were made out of this thin material and it, that really stood out to me because you can't have a thin um, cotton or stretchy, you know, legging jersey type of material on the bottom and fleece on top, not when it's, you know, 30 degrees outside. I was pretty surprised and disappointed, I want to say, because not only that's not what I was looking for, but there were no other options. I ended up getting the boy version, which was, I think, black. I literally got them black set. If you're interested to do a search yourself, go to Amazon and search for girl pants and you will see the majority are tights or leggings. I would have to search specifically for joggers to find the type of material I'm looking for. The point I'm trying to make here is that you have the male version and the female version of the exact same product, but somehow the style and material is different. The style for boys or men is loose versus the girl version, which is tight. Now, why? Why is that? Also, while you have top and bottom jersey, for girls, you have this standard leggings, thin leggings that we're used to seeing everywhere. Moving on, fast forward, I think, a couple of weeks. And for some of you that perhaps are not aware, in private school, you get a 35-page booklet on the rules. <laughs> So while I'm reading these rules, I see that girls are not allowed to wear tight clothes. That was a little bit odd to me and it was annoying, I must say, because it was just one extra worry I had. It really stood out to me that girls, it's okay for girls to wear tight clothes, but it's not okay for boys. So I'm actually thinking about this for quite a while, <laughs> trying to understand why is that. So. You know, we're just speculating here, but if we're going for, you know, boys have external body parts in the bottom section and let's try to make it comfortable and, you know, not visible. Well, girls have that as well on top. So why are we still dressing girls in, you know, tight leotards and all kinds of revealing or tight clothing? So then my search went to Amazon. I searched on every possible website for green, pants for girls. As you can imagine, the majority of the search came out for leggings. That's the society's version of pants for girls. While this video is not really about that, it's just an example of how I started questioning that. I started questioning what, you know, labels and stores are telling us to wear. Um, long story short, I actually ended up buying boys clothes. It was pretty sad. It was pretty sad to see that I had to, my only option was to look at, at a different gender to get what I want. I always like to learn from these stories and believe it or not, my children are teaching me so much. And I always draw the parallel into my life. So I started thinking about as women, what is society telling us to wear? What is our uniform, right? If the leggings is for girls, is leggings for women as well? And I kind of think it is. I want you to have a little bit of awareness that there might be a uniform out there that's kind of pushed onto you. You don't have to wear tight clothes. You don't have to have, be revealing to be attractive.
maybe you're gonna start looking at clothes differently as well don't forget ultimately it is your choice have fun uh, just enjoy everything that you are wearing it's all about you and how it makes you feel I'll see you very soon in my next video bye